and Odessa water problems leak into the city of Odessa on a day-to-day -day basis. News West 9's Rachel Ripp talked to the city today to find out just how they bottle up those water problems. It's no secret Odessa has water problems. The city knows that full well. We receive issues every day. I mean, there's always either a water main leak, a, 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 a sewer uh, stoppage, or we have uh, leaks at the meters. Um, we also have rusty water issues that we deal with routinely. So we're, we're con constantly receiving uh, issues that come in. To help, they have a methodical system for addressing these problems and a master water plan proposal down the pipeline. City Public Information Officer Devin Sanchez says that when any complaints are filed through their Citizen Problem Reporter app, the Geointelligence Division and the City Manager's Office receive it. And crews are on the clock to solve these water issues. The city is aware of the issues that have been um, reported and portrayed on other media outlets. And what we would like to do is just let residents know that we are uh, fully aware of the um, utility infrastructure issues that we have. The city's short-term solution is to routinely auto-flush pipes throughout the city to clear out water that's been sitting for too long. But the city also has a long-term water solution. They're working with council to get six to ten million dollars yearly for new pipes. We need to replace them so that we can sustain water service throughout the city. We're, we're working to get there. We certainly are. In the meantime, city officials are asking residents to be patient. It is never the city's intention to make the residents feel like they're not being heard. That is the primary um, point of the city. We work for our residents, for our citizens. And so if there is an issue, we definitely want to fix it. Reporting in Odessa, Rachel Ripp, News West 9. City officials want you to know that if you do have a complaint, you can voice it in city council meetings over the phone and through that uh, citizen problem reporter app like you just saw in that story. They recommend using all of those avenues to ensure that your voice is heard.